Another object. Hello, buddy. Woo! -hoo. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh well. Wish me luck. No front gear. Come on. Oh. Well, that was an interesting maneuver. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, my name's Tony. Well you all knew this day was going to come at some point, there was no way we'd ever get around not playing this out. I'm sorry to say, but today, we're going to become the most popular person on the battlefield. Yes, that's right, today we are playing out the G91R3, everyone's favourite jet. Now this jet's been around for a while and I'm sure many of you know it quite well. So, what do we have? We have a fairly quick jet at 8.7, not quite as fast as the MiG-15, and it definitely doesn't climb as well as the MiG-15, but the G91 handles really well. Now it does lose a lot of speed during manoeuvring as it doesn't have great energy retention, but realistically we're not focusing on it as a fighter today. Oh no. Today we're focusing on these big bad boys, the AS Nords. So what are the AS Nords? The AS Nords are air-to-ground missiles, of which we get four. 29.9 kilograms of explosives, now they're not quite as good as the bullpups on some of the American fighters, such as the FJ. They're a little bit harder to control and a little less potent. But boy oh boy do they get the job done. Now they've got an 8km firing range, which means we can launch them from some really silly distances. And as they're manually guided, we can guide them right onto our target. But we've also got 30mm cannons, 47mm of pen, meaning a lot of the lighter vehicles we can go through the top of quite easily. But as we're focusing ground today, we'll take ground targets. And these can very easily deal with jets anyway, and other planes. We'll take the A1A1 with it, I'd usually take the Rad Wagon, and I think we'll save that one for another video. And then we'll try and get our G91 up in the air. Alright, it's time to cause some mayhem. Well, well, a single cap on Japan. Hey, if we don't mess this one up, it could be pretty good. There's our first victim. Not a terrible shot, not a great shot either. He's down. Just gonna need a few more. Definitely not the shot we wanted there. I'll have him though. Can I mark this guy? Yeah. Sure can. He's gonna gladly wait all day for me. Let's use this old trick. Oh, there's more than one. Oh, my life was saved. Oh my goodness. Well, thank you very much. Now, where did our friend go? There's one. Oh, are you going to get away? No, he's not. Got enough for our G91 now as well. He's right beneath us. I think it's our friend from earlier. Ah, oh, just before we got him. Alright, I think it's about that time, guys. Bye, cruel world. Okay, Nords are on board and inbound. I'm always going to keep myself moving in this as well.
otherwise it becomes very easy to become a aid. Especially by this guy, I think he's going to have to be our first target. Swing round. Lovely. Now we've got him out of the way, we can focus a bit more on the tanks. And like I mentioned, we've got pretty bad energy retention in the G91. For ground striking, it doesn't matter too much, but I like to keep my speed up by doing loops upwards. I didn't see where this guy went, so... Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, poor BMP. I'm not sure if that object's still alive there. He is still alive. I mean, it's a bit of a waste of a Nord. But hey. See you later. I think we have enough to bring our G91 now. So let's full send it. I'm not letting you get away, buddy. You gotta be kidding me. be here for you. Oh, that, you are very lucky there. Come on, finish me off. Yes. <laughs> uh, right, let's jump in the G91. I'm not sure if that's a jet or a prop in front of us. It looks like it might be a prop or an early jet at least. Most of the zones are under control. F-84 maybe or Cougar? There we go. Oh, don't rip, don't rip, don't rip. one. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Keep it low, keep it low. Stay off the radar. Alrighty. Got our altitude. Now we can strike. Thanks. Bang on target. How about that? And we've kept our speed nice and high. We have to be careful pulling heavy manoeuvres at this speed, though, because we will rip very quickly. I can assure you of that. You shouldn't do with less Nords, but it can still happen. With full Nords, though, you rip almost immediately. There's another. Fair and balanced aircraft. But while I say that, do bear in mind the AB4 early has been added. 
<laughs> that's going to be a lot worse than this. If you think you don't like Nords, wait till you meet five bull pups. That's all I can say. And the final one. Oh, he went. We'll get that one then. Here are Heli. Where are you hiding, Heli? Oh, I see him. He crashed. <laughs> the heli crashed. <laughs> And just like that, we're in the G91. EMP. Got him. Oh, it was a Chris and Temma. Hey, hey, certainly not happy with me. <laughs> that would have been saucy. Oh yeah, baby. I think now we need some German version of Danger Zone. One away. Target destroyed. Probably attempt not to crash into each other. That is a MiG-15. I'll tell you one thing, that's not something I want to see. Two of them. You're coming with me, mate. <laughs> I definitely can't outrun a MiG-15, and not loaded like this I can't especially. I know I can outroll him though. There we go. We're pretty hurt though. And there's two, no! 